device. Welcome to Your Body at Its Best with your host, Craig Jenkins. Brought to you by Performance Medicine. It's another Wednesday. The war is on. Weight loss is our target, our enemy, our foe. Dr. Rogers is back. Dr. Robin Branca has also come back. You're dealing with the physical. She's dealing with the mental and emotional. How does that affect me practically? Dr. Rogers, you take it. Well, you know, weight loss is so common. It's really not eat less and exercise more, as most people say. It's much more complex than that. And my question to you, Robin, mm -hmm. is I see a lot of patients that come to me, I have all the tools to help them, and most people need help. They need figured out metabolically, they need my help in getting a jump start at least. Mm -hmm. But what I see in a lot of my patients is that they'll lose a lot of weight with me, Then if I don't see them back for, say, a year, a lot of times they come back and the weight's all back on. Right. And when I ask them about their life, they all say, well, I went through a divorce or I changed jobs, my kid's having problems, something like that. Right. What gives? I mean, what can I do to help or can well, you do to help? I'll us? tell you what happened. They got comfortable in this new body and they were excited about the changes that they were going to be able to make. They started making some of those changes and then they became afraid and something happened and they fell back on their old resources which are unhealthy the old frenemy as I like to call it food <laughs> so really and truly we've said this from day one Dr. Rogers when you and I first met it's a lifestyle change but although your lifestyle may change mm -hmm. you can't revert back to your old eating habits no, you and how cannot. do you maintain the dialogue with the patient that encourages them to not return. Well, you have to be very careful to make sure that they know what triggers them into those old patterns and to identify when they're doing it because you have to nip it in the bud. The sooner you quit those eating habits, the better because once you fall into it, it's easy to just, it's just like putting on your favorite pair of jeans. You just slide them on and now you're eating all the time. Is this an addiction? It is an addiction. For many people, yes. And so really you're taking it from the physical now to the emotional and the mental at performance medicine and really saw serving the entire body. Right, you have to. You're not going to be successful. You cannot just give somebody a pill for weight loss and, and say, see you later. You have, to, you have to really get to know them. You have to help them emotionally metabolically and that's kind of how we work together it's a perfect mm -hmm. team we were real successful with it folks get by and see them they're the best at what they do and the war on weight loss is on at performance medicine performance medicine dot net